Well, without figures like Snowden, without figures like Manning, without figures like Julian Assange, um, essentially the blinds are drawn. We have no window into what's being done in our name, including the crimes that are being done in our name. Uh, again, I, you know, having worked as an investigative reporter, the, the, the lifeblood of my work were figures like these, who had the moral courage to stand up. Uh, and name the crimes that they witnessed. And these people are always at the moment that they stand up. And even King, of course, was persecuted and reviled and denounced, hounded by uh, J. Edgar Hoover, who attempted through blackmail to get him to commit suicide before accepting the Nobel Prize. Let's not forget that all of these figures, like Snowden, come under this character assassination, which, frankly, I think Professor Stone is engaging in. Uh, and that's not uncommon. Uh, that, that's what comes with the territory when you carry out an act of conscience. It's a very lonely uh, and frightening. Uh, and, and it makes these figures, like Snowden, deeply courageous, uh, because the I mean, the whole debate, traitor or whistleblower, uh, for me, I, you know, hearing this on the press is watching the press commit collective suicide, because without those figures, there is no press.